guys uh just wanted to make a video on how to successfully decock your sks rifle um i've heard from some people you know facebook page what have you if you're on the sks facebook page i am myself and uh i also saw a youtube video of someone trying to explain how to decock the rifle by taking off the dust cover um just so happens not the case and uh, is a complete waste of time. So I have here is uh, my Type 56 Norinco rifle. Um, fun fact for everyone, anyone else who has a Norinco Type 56, if it is a Arsenal 26, it is actually a Russian-made rifle in China during the Cold War and uh, was made by Norinco so it can be imported to the United States. Um, Anyway, besides that, uh, so the proper way to decock your SKS. Um, no magazine, no round the chamber. So what you're going to want to do to practice a little bit, cock the rifle, bolt back, slide forward. Um, you know, it's kind of the same as an AK, only obviously not. Um, my friend was given an AK and was showing me how to decock it. Uh, I had my SKS for quite some time. And uh, grew up shooting my dad's SKS. And uh, with the AK, you know, pull the bolt halfway, pull the trigger, slide forward, it's decock. Um, I tried that with this, did not work. So uh, I was just playing around with it, you know, just dead set on figuring out how to decock my, decock my rifle. You know, not that, you know, you really ever need it. But um, so the correct way is you want to pull the trigger halfway in. And then my personal preference is uh, just a few centimeters, maybe a little under an inch, pull the bolt back, and then decocked. Uh, a way to know that the weapon is decocked is uh, the bolt is not fully closed like it would be if the weapon was cocked and ready to fire. Um, so... As you can see right there, the bolt is fully closed. The rifle is ready to fire. Um, so you can do this with a round in the chamber. Um, I've done it outside shooting. Not going to do it in here just because I'm in my home. I uh, trust myself with the rifle, but things happen. Strange things happen every day. So again, uh, trigger halfway pulled, halfway in. Pull the bolt down about an inch or you know wherever you want really and just pull the trigger rest of the way let's let the bolt slide forward a little bit um again the bolt will not be fully closed you can still see somewhat inside the chamber when it's decocked so uh yeah i just uh i just saw you know some people on the sks facebook page and uh here on youtube Saying so you need to take the dust cover off, pull the bolt out, what have you. Um, not the case and a complete waste of time. I'm sure it works or else, you know, lots of people wouldn't be doing it. But uh, that, what I've just shown you is the correct way to uh, decock your SKS rifle. Um, it's going to take a few times to practice. First few times I attempted, I did dry fire my rifle. Um, you get the hang of it. Now it's just... Uh, now it's kind of kind of like second nature now, um, so it's gonna it's gonna take a few tries. Uh, this method works on most variants of SKS rifles. I haven't picked a SKS variant up that this method method won't work on. Um, but you know, then again, I don't know. It it could could not. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to make the video because uh, you know I. Just seeing people take the dust cover off and pulling the bolt out, playing with it, you know, it doesn't, it's just a waste of time. So if you're ever, you know, in need to decock your rifle or just, you know, just to kind of make sure uh, that was the proper use, uh, hope you guys liked it. Uh, thank you for watching.